This is Jim Hamilton. I'm a group director with InfoTrends, and I have in my hands here a print sample of a men's magazine that was done on the new ImageStream 3500. Uh, I picked it up at a Canon event at IWCO Direct in Minnesota, their direct mailer, um, and they have the 3500 on uh, essentially first customer placement sort of test. Um, this piece is interesting because it's one of the first examples of the class of high-speed continuous feed inkjet devices where you're printing on uh, coded offset stock. So as you can see, this is kind of the uh, you know a, a magazine catalog publication sort of example where the coverage is very high, quality levels uh, are expected to be very high, uh, and therefore the ability to print at uh, 1200 by 1200 DPI, uh, 525 feet per minute uh, with a very small drop size, two picoliters, uh, allows you to ch achieve very strong quality levels. Now, actually, the cover on this piece was printed on another device. It was printed on a Canon, Canon uh, ImagePress 7010 VPS. Uh, the internals, though, were on the ImageStream uh, 3500, so high speed inkjet output. This was printed on a UPM finesse gloss uh, stock. Again, at 1,200 by 1,200 DPI. Um, in, very interesting to see this sample. Uh, good to know that Canon is at a spot where, uh, even though this is, this is sort of an early customer placement, uh, that they're ready to hand out samples. These were given out to analysts and to the, the customers and prospects who attended that particular event. I thought one of the comments that IWCO Direct made was very interesting. Now, they're more uh, you know, doing direct mail rather than publications, but they talked about the value of being able to print uh, an entire uh, direct mail campaign without having to commingle from various sources. And if you're able to print at high-speed inkjet at these quality levels on this kind of stock, then you can do that. So that's an interesting advantage. At the same event, I also did pick up samples from the new VarioPrint i300, so that's a cut sheet inkjet device, but I'll save that discussion for another time.